After the Tempest Wars in Asteria, causing the horrific events of the Divine Fracture, the remaining Canaan kings were able to rebuild and stabilize their territories. And in doing this, they created the Kingdom of Bornalia and its capital religion, Divinus. One of the ways this kingdom is able to prosper is its geographical location. Since half of the year it's autumn and half of the year it's spring, they are always able to have food readily available to them. And because these were the remaining people after the Divine Fracture, that religion taught them that they had to atone for their sins of using magic as a destructive power. You know, when I started writing this story, I was really, really into the concept of sacred kingship. And before technology, throughout all of our lives, we used to use religion as a political concept where like the ruler was a manifestation of the sacred or the holy. And even in our own past, before kingdoms and cultures ever even knew about each other, all of these religious institutions, there was not one kingdom that was not in some sense sacral. I wanted to utilize something that was relatable to the players so that when you're learning about this world and this kingdom, we can kind of look at ourselves and our own past and relate to it. And when we look to our past and our own humanity, we can think how many atrocities and great things were done in the name of religion. I'm really glad I get to share this artistic journey with everyone. And thank you to everyone who sits down and listens to these stories and watches these videos. Thanks again, guys.